starting lineup for UP on your screens. And we'll be taking a look at FEU starting lineup. A chance for FEU here. Something new. Oh, what a solid two man block there coming from FEU. From behind the attack line and all alone there, number six. Medyo ano din, ano masakit kasi kakalabanin niya yung FE, yung kanyang alma mater. And that one looked good. Because to be able to draw from that kind of experience at the collegiate level. As we take a look at that first ace coming from Eliza Bertolano. It looks like she's in good shape. Strong, fit. Lakas ng serve. And that is another point. Sigal Mahida. Well, this is something that UP will take advantage of with Bertolano at the service line because she's been serving really well for fighting maroons and a smart play there. I guess energy that si Coach Tina wants to also bring into her girls. Yung familiarity din, di ba? Yung alam niya, speak their language. Idaanin niyo sa ano. You know how important it is when the school comes together to sing their hymns at the end of the, the games. Back to the match here now. Still talaga a challenge here for Fiona Encarnacion. That's three blocks already for FEU and four we've seen on the side of UP. So both squads doing well in that department. And that one is called outside, or at least FEU is insisting. He said, we have a good receive, we have good defense, but um, the attacking has to uh, be strong and smart. Because he said, we just lost it. So there's really a difference when you're um, trying to spike to kill the ball, and when you're just spiking to get the ball over the net. In this game today, oh, it's a good serve. Nice reception there by Jewel. Fernandez timing it. Very efficient opposite player, Jose Fernandez, no? Has been contributing a lot. I guess, just needs to get more points in the attack. What a great one there. And Fernandez. that was, Yeah. Oh, oh, control niya. Because we're talking about Tim Ubaldo, the second year setter from FEU. Good hustle yes. from UP. And now FEU will... We set, and that was a great execution there. So Coach Shaq looking for the uh, rhythm and I guess the system to kick in on the side of UP. Bertolano, wow, wala. The blockers weren't there. Let's see if he can get started, and this is good that we have Bertolano, or that UP has Bertolano to serve, but ball right back to you, the uh, FEU. And surely Fernandez has the hot hands today. Eight points already. Rojo Fernandez of FEU. And that one, set up Fernandez. Behind there. Bonafé. Oh, that worked out. Babe Bonafé, the setter now, who was responsible for getting that play going. She's the replacement setter on the court now. Too strong. Nagaon. 25 16, the final score for this first set. Point and the ball. Three serving four. FU already took the first set. 25 16 there. Parang it's a one on one. Si Tagaon. Chaka si Bertolano. Nakikita natin. Eh. Si Bertolano nakakatanggap ng mga palo ni Tagaon. And asses this time. And Bertolano goes nowhere. But Coach Tina has also a lot of knowledge and wisdom that she can share into her players. So I'm sure Ubaldo gets a lot of inspiration, especially because, you know, you're looking at another strong and fierce female. Yeah. But it seems like they can feel the rhythm, that thing that was missing on the side of UP. So let's see if they can hold that. And again, that is uh, off the block there. Stay in step with FEU. The girls in green have now taken a two-point lead. Celis just gets the ball right back in that point. <laughs> Chaka, you know when you're in there, means hindi mo na feel na niya yung game. Uh -huh. And you want to pray na hindi nila makikita <laughs> kasi it's so fast. Oh, that one was fast too. Fernandez coming from the right side, her favorite spot. A more tightly contested set. Good reception we're seeing from FEU. Those are challenging serves that Lupi is giving them. Oh, good up. Encarnacion timing it. And you see from her approach, 
here in the UAE Men's Edition. Ethan, one of the taller players, five foot eleven, is the tallest player in fact on the side of UP. Yeah, and here it's working now. So now I'm excited how it's gonna translate in the game. Coach Tina mentioned we need to be in control, and that's important now because the attacks on UP now are yeah. becoming more aggressive. Then they put in Kari. Kari Cruz. Kari Cruz. FEU. Two players on the side of the pass. Nagalam, what form! What a shoot! Kahit ganito yung play, tuloy mo pa rin, taas mo yung set. Let's see if they can get that. It's a reverse number three on the front row there, but Nagalam is relentless. You really want to kill it? Yeah. And give them that stop. Pauline, the stage is the same. It's uh, they play in the biggest arena and they have such a strong following, and that kind of pressure can get to you. So the simulation really uh, should go well for these girls. Back to the action here in the arena, and look at that. That's a good reception. Back to attack. Good enough for Tagawad. Eight serving eleven now. with a quick put away. That was a... Oh, that's a good serve there. And she gets a good dig. Vivasora going down the line, but Liza was there. And that's Pustrilio from the right side this time. Obaldo with a cover. From back row, and what a good substitution here. FE with a huge lead now, seven points. Struggling with their first ball. Yeah. Sora getting it past Itang this time. Both teams uh, looking at the southern front, so only two spikers in the front line. Oh, that's inside. Not just a setter, but she's an attacking setter, getting points of her own. Wow! Wow, wow Salis! Salis. 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 can save them. Yeah, stranger things have happened. Let's see if they can pull a comeback here. There's a good reception for again. Here's a chance for UP to stay with this game. Baldo now. Back set to Cusano. Coming from the right side. That put away in a win for this third set. On the line now, Ali De Vesora. Seven. Wow. This is the best place to do it. This is the best time to really show your potential and to shine. Especially when you're alongside Encarnacion ah. and Bertolano. Yes. You know, you get inspiration from your teammates. Good stop there. Itang couldn't put that one away just yet. But she has a block. And ball's right back to Yupi. Exchanges here. Quick. The blocking efficient on both sides. Oh, oh gandang habol. Bertolano and Karnashon making do. What a rally. Oh, great coverage by Itang. And Karnashon one more time. Oh, Ball's still alive. Ball's still good. Ball's still good. Excellent defense on both sides. Kiseo tries again. 
Then set. a little bit about the challenge system which will make its way to the UAAP come the second round. So we have that to look forward to as well. Definitely not. It's tricky. It's timing. Mm. Oh. Wow. And it's FAU's turn now to play catch up. Four point deficit for them. But this is a must win fourth set for UP. So we feel the intensity on the side of the girls in white today. Just one point behind after a few timely errors. And uh, so already with 10 points. And suddenly they're tied at 13. Three balls. If you can get the lead back here, Australia goes out. Another deadlock, but not for long. Basilio <laughs> wanting the ball back and the lead. <laughs> deadlock, Pauline, and again, this is more important. Yupi really struggling to stay in it. But Yupi now has the ball back. They need to make up two points. Oh, what a block. Great cover there, though, by Tagaon. And Jers again. Good defense by the Maroons. Oh, wow, look at that. Itam, she knows it. And that was just a parang halos easy over lang yun, pero pinatay na niya. And Yuki, even things out here. They defend well, but no. That's a far angle to get. It's a tricky angle to get. Itam now with a serve. Uh, off system, back row, the Astagaod. Before you can count on your teammates, count on yourself. Oh, that's exactly what Batalha did. Hindi lang talaga tumuwid sa net. Even at 23 apiece late in this fourth set. Are we looking at a fifth set here? Let's see what Yupi does. Oh, that is definitely inside. Getting fired up here. This match. 